What's up YouTube? Nexus here bringing you a black and white Wi-Fi battle. This one is a different match, of course. This is for my hat cup match. Uh, not to be dramatic or anything, it's just where you, the rules were in you Pokemon, hack, any ability, any moveset, say no Wonder Guard, and try not to make it super fucking broken. Like slacking a Regigigas, pretty much are the most broken Pokemon in this tier, uh, without their abilities that hinder them as such. So any like boosting attack or speed or anything like that, like huge power which you guess or huge power slacking, that would be just over the top. Any move, uh, I suggest be creative. I kind of wanted to make a move set to my Pokemon that kind of made a little bit of sense. Uh, some of them didn't, but I mean, whatever. Uh, anyway, let's get this match started. You can't really tell anything about the team previews, by the way, because, uh, yeah, no one knows what the hell anything is anymore. It's one of those days. And let's get this match started. He lead, uh, he leads off with Zeus, his Electabuzz. I'm gonna lead off with God, Dunsparce. He's gonna set up the sand for me here. I'm wondering what his ability is gonna be. I'm gonna see like a Swords Dance sort of set come up with speed boost in a second. I'm like, oh shit, fucking Swords Dance Fusion Bolt, everything dies sort of set. I'm thinking. So I'm gonna go for me first, but I was like, oh, I should go for the Snatch, but I don't know how those moves work really. So obviously I'm stupid. So I'm going to go for the Body Slam, because Body Slam, Body Slam, Body Slam is my stab move, and uh, it's good. So uh, pretty much if he goes for, I think, uh, Bolt Strike, that would have one-shot me regardless. Also, uh, Fusion Bolt would have also one strike. Even Wild Charge, I believe, is going to kill me. I was hoping to get the uh, Parahags, but of course I'm not going to get it. I'm going to get buffered by the Sandstorm. So yeah, this is not looking good so far. Uh, but I do have somewhat of an answer, I'm hoping, to this uh, speed boosting monstrosity. Uh, so it's going to get locked into Outrage, which is good, because that was weird, though. Weird Outrage comes out of nowhere. So, yeah, now Zeus is going to get buffed by the storm. So we already know this is speed boosting, source dancing, Outrage. I think he said it actually did have Fusion Bolt. So I know he's locked in Outrage, and he's going to get confused. So I'm going to switch into my Robo Jockey and go for the. Uh, do I go for the nasty pull? I'm not sure if I do or not. I'm gonna go for the, straight for the side strike, hoping to take this thing out, and I rely on side strike because it sucks. Because I haven't set up any uh, nasty plots. This is a weird Biolite nasty plot robo jockey with levitate. Who said is uh, nasty plot? Flat? Uh, nasty plot? Side strike? Uh. I don't know, I think it's Flash Cannon or something like that. I forgot. Uh, the only move I'll probably be using is Side Strike. Oh yeah, Dark Pulse. I have Dark Pulse. That's it. Nasty Plot, Dark Pulse. Uh, Protect, I think, too, maybe? I'm not sure. I'll check that out later. But he's going to go for the Muddy Water here. Uh, I don't forgot what this... Uh... Oh yeah, it's a uh, freaking Lightning Rod. Uh, Mantine. That's like super broken. <laughs> I was like, okay, what's this? Oh, lightning rod. Well, that makes sense. Uh, I was thinking about running something like that, but I was like, nah, that's too, too much. And I was either going to go with heat proof, uh, you know, Robo Jockey or, or Levitate. Levitate just seemed fine. So I'm going to go for the night. Oh, it's night days, not dark bolts. So, yeah. Uh, sadly, that thing is really bulky. Uh, Should have went for the side strike to finish it off. I was pretty sure the night days would do it, but uh, whatever. So he's going to go for the second punch here, and I was just going to go for the, I don't know, just something. Uh, maybe my last move was a fighting move, I'm not sure, maybe focus blast or something. But I want to sit in that big threat, that low punny, with that technician boost. So technician boosted, fake out, and I'm like, wow, that didn't, did hardly anything. So here I'm thinking, alright, technician, super effective, boosted, storm throw that's always crits, it's going to be awesome, right? It's like, yeah, that's going to finish it off from there probably. Nope. It does a lot, but it doesn't do enough. So I'm like, well, that's just wasted. Good thing I have the priority, uh, actually I don't think I have priority on this thing, except for, uh, Shadow Sneak. Which, I'm not sure if I go for, but I think I outspeed it anyway. Uh, so I'm gonna go for the Shadow Sneak here. Hoping that I finish it off with, uh, Technician Boost. And it does, actually, surprisingly. I was actually stinging my live with 1 HP. It's that big threat doing work, and yeah, I think the moveset on this is uh, Technician, Life Orb, Fake Out, Flame Will, Storm Throw, and Shadow Sneak. So, I'm gonna go for the Extreme Speed, which is gonna take me out. This is a Regenerator, Regigigas, which is like, I was like, fucking shit, Regenerator, god, it's gonna be impossible to kill. 
Um, so, at this point, I'm like, okay, I'm going to send in Zoroark, which is uh, uh, my Illusion Dust Skull, which I didn't get to really use this match, because Lopunny was in the last slot, and it was supposed to be, you know, I was going to take out Lopunny. But things change. He's going to imposter my uh, my uh, own Zoroark. I'm going to go for the Toxic here. And uh, he can only go for the Toxic. He's probably a Choice Scarfed uh, imposter with, like, you know, a bunch of HP and speed uh, in his guy. Oh, actually, Leftovers. So he's Leftovers Imposter. Uh, he's got a lot of HP, so it probably is a good, you know, Imposter abuser. So I have to protect here knowing that he really has nothing, because uh, this moveset is just Toxic, Nightshade, um, Wish Protect. So, so a pretty supportive set. Uh, with Illusion, it's supposed to, like, basically, like, dumb out an opponent, Toxic them, and then basically stall them out for a little bit longer. Uh, basically come in, disguise another boat, stall out, and, you know, do stuff. So, I was going to get a Toxic here. I was hoping Sand Veil, but that's because this is a Sand Veil uh, Whiskash with a pretty freaking standard set. Substitute, Dragon Dance, Waterfall, Earthquake. So, yeah, no fancy moves here on this guy. It's just his ability has changed. So, this is... I'm not going to appreciate this Toxic because it's going to limit my sweeping abilities to basically Zitch, Nil, None, Nada. So he's going to switch in Kronos, which I said we so he's at full health again, but that Life Orb is actually a pretty good combination. Um, I would think Belly Drum Regenerator would be awesome, but that's just me. Uh, of course, someone could build that and fight me, but I don't care. <laughs> uh, Dragon Dancing, do the Dragon Dance here, hoping that I can actually do some stuff. This match actually turns out to be kind of close, because I was actually expecting... Uh, I don't know what else to think. He's gonna tox, uh, get toxic off something here. Right? I guess, yeah. Um, so that guy's gonna be able. Uh, apparently, he doesn't know that imposter, uh, imposter does not look to a sub, which will come into play soon unless he has an attacking move and then just has an actual set. Because he's gonna switch out here and go into Dionysus, thinking that I guess imposter will work through it. I know that for a fact that imposter does not work through subs. Because I was like, ditto, go, and it's like, imposter does not activate, I'm like, transform does not activate, I'm like, substitute, what is wrong with you? So yeah, I'm going to go for that hit, and it's going to kill it, and I'm going to get leftovers back, but Toxic is going to wreck up, and I'm limiting, limiting my ability right here. So he's going to switch into his Athena, which is his Guard of War. I'm not sure what this ability was again. Um, oh my god. Uh, I'm not sure. It was, didn't really do anything, so I'm not sure what this ability was. Uh, yeah, that was weird. <laughs> so now I'm down to my last like a little bit of HP. He's going to switch in Chronos, which is going to uh, his last Pokemon. And I know I probably can't kill it, but he's going to take out my uh, thing, which really didn't matter because I am going to die to uh, Toxic anyway. Uh, so there was really no point in anything, I guess. So he just went for the extreme speed anyway. Um, I'm going to take. Waterfall, he's gonna actually take that pretty nicely, which is sad. Uh, but he's gonna take some sand from But since he can't switch out, Regenerator's not gonna come and help him. And I'm gonna switch into the probably the most broken Pokemon on my team, uh, Escadrille, which is my Marowak with Sand Rush, which is awesome. I'm just gonna finish off with a Drain Punch. The set is Earthquake, Drain Punch, um, Double Edge, and uh, Rock Slide, I think, or Stone Edge, I'm not sure. Anyway, that's a good game. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, check out his channel, which will be in the link in, to his channel in the description. And, uh, yeah, this, this challenge still stands, so if you want to get out there challenge me to a hat cup match, go ahead, check out the rules, check out the last video. And I'll catch you guys later. Peace.